my most used to be I this is Vitrano Ivern and welcome back to Super Paper Roblox episode number two. So we basically left off we basically left off at, at finishing episode two. Uh we uh found a magical pair of scissors that was found in a mansion. So basically, uh I forgot what we were supposed to do because it's it's now a new day, so I'll just go to the post office, and and then it'll hopefully jog my memory on what I'm supposed to do. Haha, <laughs> get it? Because, uh, something in the game. Okay. Okay, a time pace. You, once you are finished with your current... Oddity Wood. I have... M okay, Oddity... Oddity little Wood. Um... Okay, so I'm on chapter three... That's chapter five, okay. Oh, pff, it was right next to me. Why Why am I being so stupid? I'll tell piggies, just open up the way to the forest. Lucky you. Okay. Oh my god. Oh look, it's Dusekar. Yeah, we showed my brother who's boss. Anyways, i like you to be my old chum, Dusekar. We go way back. Hello, protagonist. You most likely heard about me already. I'm the creator of Paper Robloxia. However, I'm in a bit of a fix right now. What is it? This necromancer who's been running around causing trouble has finally done it. He's stolen my plot book, which he may very well use to throw our world into chaos. Uh, yeah, about that. What does it do exactly? The book essentially allows anyone to control and manipulate the universe with ease. You can only imagine the consequences this may entail. Yeah, that's a bummer. We also need to find the next pair of scissors. I think there's one hidden inside the oddity tree. Maybe Otebe knows something about it. Alright. I know Dusekar, uh, he, he's a Roblox admin in the, uh, actual website. That's a little fun fact for you guys to know. Oh, okay, more spikes. Ooh, I got a card of Dusekar! Uh, not what I was intentionally going for, but okay. Ooh. And I got killed by spikes, that's amazing. Okay, at least it gave me the short way. Wait, we have to jump this? Ooh. Well, how am I supposed to jump that? Oh, I see. Oh, did you see that? My arm touched the spike. <laughs> okay, here we go. There we go. Uh, And then jump off here. Uh, oh my god, what is- what the hell is that? Wheel, I'm one of the whistles who live in Oddity Wood. The rest of the whistles are waiting for you at Mirage P Pagoda. Alright. Oh, look, it's scriptless. Oh, hey there, you noticed too, haven't you? All these spikes everywhere. Someone just trapped this whole place. Anyways, I just paid a visit to Otepe's and Boxdra. You'll find them if you climb up this tree. Okay. Oh my god. Uh, it seems that you've received my hasty invitation to meet me here. As you see, as a... I'd like you to do a small favor for me. As a guardian of balance, it is my duty to maintain harmony in Paper Robloxia. However, there is one specific task that Boxtra and I are assigned to, which I'd like you to help us with. Alright. There are two extremely... There are two extremely powerful areas within Paper Robloxia where the highest concentrations of dark and light energy are found. They are called the Rift of Light and Rift of Darkness. I am particularly worried about the Rift of Darkness, which is located inside the Oddity Tree deep within these woods. I fear that the ill-intentioned necromancer might have his sights set on it. Unfortunately, Boxtra is feeling very sick, so she will be resting here for a while. However, I will still be present on this journey. I will be waiting in front of the oddity, oddity tree. Your assistance is much appreciated. 
The way to the oddity tree is around the back of the pagoda. Oh, uh, no. Wait, did you know that a top base once led an entire army in a battle? With a steed as fierce as Boxtra, he was unstoppable back in the day. Okay. <sighs> Time to do more parkour. Uh, Alright. I like how they put conventionally placed that bush there. Ooh, whoa! I okay, this looks like some average Robloxian. <gasps> I'm the one who scatters your world with spikes. I am Spoke, king of all things sharp. You've got to be kidding me. Ah, but you see, something's quite sharp yourself. A pair of magic scissors, perhaps. How unfortunate. The treasure you sh seek is guarded by the Void Star. It will destroy you in no time. May as well give up now. Ooh, such ambition. But I'm afraid this dark entity has grown far too powerful. It's best not to challenge it. Oh, well, it's your funeral. Bitch, please. I got MLG gaming skills. I'm pretty sure I can do this. Okay. Who in the world was back there? It can't be... And the way he was talking about the Void Star? No, it can't be true. The Void Star is a powerful crown that belongs to one- Oh no. 1x1 to x1. In real life, he's a hacker. He was a famous hacker. The god of Void. Yet the Void Star should be locked inside the heart of Banlin with 1 times 1 times 1 times 1 himself. If Spoke's warning is anything to go by, we could be in some serious trouble. But that remains to be seen. Let's just focus on getting inside Oddity Tree. Yeah, in real life, one times one times one times one is a uh, is a famous, uh, notorious hacker. Uh, back in the day, uh, basically he would uh screw up any game that uh in s that he sees in sight. Uh, he's a moderator on Vermillion, and I know that for sure. Um, oh, God damn these spikes. Oh, okay, what was that? Ooh. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Come on. This frickin'... Okay, I have to time this shit perfectly. Okay, there we go. Um. Oh, another mailman. Hey, Mr. Postman. Hmm, there's a shiny gold letter here with your name on it. Would you like to read it? Sure. I'm trying to click the button. This is an exclusive invitation granted upon the luckiest Robloxians in Paper Robloxia. You are invited to the new spectacular casino in Cutout Town. Casino Centavado. Just look for the gigantic purple building with a yellow star shape on top. Huh, so it's from the new casino that just opened up. It's probably some straight. I've heard some pretty strange things about that place. Maybe it's worth checking out. Anyways, this letter can be stored in the Cuttown Post Office. You can reread all your letters there. Yeah, like I care. Oh god, there's so much parkour here. Oh my god. Look at all this parkour. Oh, we could get a car do going this way. But anyways, I'm pretty decent at parkour. Alright, here we go. Thanks for the card, Vanine. Alright, we got three. Uh, as I was looking at my last video, it turns out I missed a card in the prologue. Apparently there was a card in the prologue and I missed it. But I'm probably going to do some exclusive episodes to see what happens when you get all the cards. Okay, come on. Alright, here we go. Oddity tree, here we go. Alright, here we go. Whoa. Okay, this is really well designed. What? Is that the... No! How is this possible? The Void Star vanishes, having drained the Rift of Darkness of all of its energy. This is a very, very, very bad sign. Who or what could have managed to get a hold of the Void Star? I fear the very worst. 
Oh my god, okay. I must investigate this further. In the meantime, I suggest you hop down this hole where the Rift of Darkness was a moment ago. There's a pair of magic scissors down here. Thank you for taking the time to come here with me. I'll try to figure out what all this all means. If I find any leads, I'll be sure to tell you. Oh. Scissors! Scissors! Okay, so we're supposed to go to this casino, perhaps? Oh, I see it. Yeah, I see it. But I really don't have a good feeling about this. Cut out town, urban district. Ooh. I haven't seen this part of the map before. Well, anyways. Girl, I know there's a pair of scissors around here. I can smell it. Can't get through the gate, though. You need to be invited by the casino's dumb management to get... This is gonna be... I was invited. Oh, really? That's great news. Just hop in there and grab them already. There's no time to lose. Alright. Hey there, I'm Tucker Trillion, gabber gambling extraordinaire from Seaview, Vegas. So you've been invited here too. Yeah. So how come there are no traces of anyone else here besides the two of us? I thought this was going to be some huge grand opening parade or something. Maybe everyone's already waiting for us inside still. I can't shake off the feeling that there's someone something odd about this place. Let's go inside it and see for ourselves. Uh, is there some card? Yep. That's what I thought. I'm gonna try looking for as many cards as I can. Uh, there's a bird. Oh wait, that's a cardboard bird. <laughs> All right, let's go in. Whoa. Okay, more fancy parkour. Hmm. This is not exactly what I expected. It looks like some kind of obstacle course. What? Let's see what we can find. Okay, I have no I I have no problem with parkour. Pa parkour is super easy. Wait, can we Okay, we can stand on this. Um Okay, this bounces us good. All right, jump. I can imagine why a pool table might be here, but not the electric fences. There's something fishy going on here. Oh, oh, I see. I see. There we go. Uh, we're supposed to jump on this one. Alright, here we go. And... Jump! <gasps> Ooh, my nine! That was close. Alright, here we go. And we did it. Oh man, there's another fucking card over there. I actually want to go back and get it. Ooh. Oh man, I'm afraid that's too late though. Damn it. Uh, oh crap. Oh, I know what to do. Oh god. You wanna fight me, bro? You wanna fight me? Ooh. That's what I thought. Anyways, ooh, okay. Yeah, this parkour ain't taking it kindly. I played another game made by Explode One, uh, and the, some of the parkour he did was actually kind of crazy. So this is actually kind of no surprise. But except for the detail, the detail was very well done. But man, this is some tough parkour here. Okay, here we go. Oh, oh, another card. I'll take this. Crap, 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 crap. Uh, stop pushing me. Oh, oh man, nine. Okay, let's go down here. 
Uh, oh! Everybody's here! The Postman. Oh my god. So we got Mr. Postman. We got... Oh, shit! Alright. What the hell's happening here? Hello, is this thing- Oh my god. Hello, is this thing on? Can anyone hear me? Yeah, we can hear you, but who are you? And where in the world are we? My name is Antagon. I'm the necromancer who shall soon unleash terror across your delicate world. I have watched your pitiful lives from afar, planning and exploiting under your very noses. Ah, uh, whatever. Can we just play some slots or something? Pretty lame casino, if you ask me. This is obviously no ordinary casino. You let us all into some kind of trap. Correct, you've all fallen right into this cell, and quite a luxurious one at that. I'm honestly baffled that every single one of you fell for it. I mean, come on, it was obviously staged. I knew it, by the way. I knew it. something was fishy. Yeah, I expected as much. I, I'm very fishy for all casinos, just so you know. So why exactly did you trap us all here? What's the point? He wants something from us. He wants our money. Well, I won't let you have it. No, I actually plan to capture the very person who has been working against my schemes. Can you guess who it is? It's me. Yes! You! You've been going around lately collecting magic scissors to get a hole in reality to find me. Well, this time I turned on your own weapons against me. You mean the scissors. Precisely. I've hidden a pair of scissors within the casino to lure you into my trap. And it works like a charm. What? Intago did all this just to capture you? Hope you have fun in rotting in here, and please don't damage the extra deluxe furniture I just bought for this occasion. Intagon signing off. Intagon's screen turns off. Oh, fuck's sake. <sighs> okay, what are we supposed to do here? Walls closing in, running out of. Oh, shit! So that's what's happening? Okay. Maybe Mr. <sighs> this is why I never leave my house. Please tell me there's a bathroom in here somewhere. Okay. What? Well, this whole place really was a trap. We better find a way out and fast. Oh, fuck, man. What about this? Uh, sh crap. Crap. Uh, wait, what? Okay. <gasps> Maybe through the TV. Maybe through the TV, for all we know. Ah, uh, okay, we can't go through the TV. Hey, someone sent you another letter. Would you like to read it? Greetings, protagonist. Once your exposition for the casino is finished, well, come to the large round door that's near town hall. We have much to discuss for targeting Antagon's schemes and what our next move should be. That's assuming we can even get out of here. Uh, I bet one of these is a teleporter. Seriously, I'm, I'm actually kind of stuck here. Alright. See you guys in a bit. Okay, so it turns out, if you talk to every person, it eventually makes some progress, so all the people have moved to new positions. So let's see what they gotta say. If you were looking for the mailman, he just disappeared. He literally vanished into thin air. Oh, maybe if I had that power up, I probably would get away. I.e., get me out of this crazy place. Is it just me, or are there fewer people in this room than before? Hey, did you feel that? I said, I finally just felt a sudden draft of wind. Where did it come from? Hey, who turned on the air conditioning? Ugh, I don't have time for this. Let us out already. Did someone already find a secret exit? Where is it? Alright. I'm just going to take a little nap. Wow, he just cleared.
collapsed on the couch. That's impressive. Oh my god. Hey, this is it. This is the end. These are my last time breaths. Oh my god, such a dramatic. Okay, I apologize about my co-worker, Mr. Explode. He doesn't take the whole, whole idea of being locked up into a cell very well. Well, no shit, nobody can. There's definitely fewer people than there was before. What will become of us? We are just going to... We are, all, are we all just going to disappear? No, this can't be happening. There must be a thermostat somewhere around here. It's getting way too chilly. Where in the world did everyone go? It's gotten so much quieter in here. Oh, God. Yep, there definitely has become fewer people. Hey, it's you, isn't it? You're the one who's making everyone disappear. Don't look at me like that. Tiger mentioned the possibility of someone in here making everyone disappear, but I can't help but think he might be onto something. There must be someone in here who's responsible for all this. They must be making everyone disappear, but who is it? How, how much time has passed already? Minutes, hours, days, weeks, months, years? Oh, great. More. They moved again. Uh, okay. What are the last two remaining? It was you, wasn't it? You were the one who has been making everyone disappear. It has to be you. Who are you, really? Ah, uh, It's the Void Star! Look it, it's the Void Star! The Void Star engulfs you in shadows, leaving nothing behind. Oh, she. Okay, we got out of the room. Okay, oh no, it's a maze! It's a maze! Why did it have to be a maze? Oh, hey, I suppose I should apologize for losing my cool back there. Apparently, that weird black ring was teleporting all of us here one at a time. That was the Void Star. You never cease to surprise me with new information. I, I suppose I shouldn't judge you because of it. Now, who we are trapped in a giant gravity-flipping maze. This isn't much of an improvement for our situation a few moments ago. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Oh, what the hell? Oh no! It's gonna change gravity! Oh my god, this is so disorientating! Jesus Christ, my nine! Okay, so that- apparently that way doesn't work. Okay, that way doesn't work. Okay. Let's go. Here. Well, at least it isn't freezing like it was back in that cell. It's actually kind of toasty here. Alright, here we go. I tried to organize every one at certain crossroads of the maze to make it easier to find the exit, but it's a lot of them just can't sit still while we try to figure this out. Maybe it's this one. Okay, here we go. I think I know it's why it's called Lucky Labyrinth. It takes some insane luck to get out of here. Or just lots of MLG skills. Alright, here we go. Oh, Mr. Explode! Grr, this card stack isn't tall enough. Well, track back to the drawing board! Oh, oh, okay, here we go. Okay, so we got two of them here. Which one is actually going to help us out? Okay, I'm looking at it. Okay, it, it looks like only the left one is actually going to help us. Well, where is the end? Anyways. If I can climb to the frickin' top of this... Where's the end? Oh, it's right there! Okay. There's two switches, but only one of them will go the right way. Yeah, that's what I thought. This one looks like it will take you nowhere.
we're near the end. I can smell it. The scissors, you know. I can smell the magic scissors. You know how with scare it can smell them. Okay, so we probably have taken the right way. <gasps> well, we can get to the center. With all this ver gravity switching, I wonder. It's a wonder how I haven't dropped a single letter. Oh, we got a card of the other dude who's with Mr. Explode. <gasps> oh, oh, wait. Where is it? Oh, it's right over there. Oh, my God. Come on. we Can we do this? Damn it. We're barred out. Uh, it looks like we're going to have to take this one. Ugh, my head's spinning from all the gravity switching. I'm going to lose... I'm gonna lose by lunch. Oh my god. That's kind of disturbing. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, and then we go to this one. Alright, and then... Oh no. Did we just fall into an infinite loop? Oh no, wait, we didn't. Alright, here we go. Nope, that's a dead end. Okay. I saw a card behind here. Don't think you can hide from me. Alright, here we go. Alright, we did it! Yeah, we did it! Okay, everyone apparently made it somehow. There's the exit, let's go! Thanks for fighting for the exit for us. It was getting really musty back there. Daylight, a warm breeze, bird singing, a glorious ballad of freedom. We made it. Too bad all Robloxians are not like that. Wow, you made it through all of Antagon's traps. You really are the de real deal. Well, we'll be going now. Take care. Protagonist, I thought th I was the protagonist of the story. Maybe next time in your dreams. At least we made it out unsafe. I was afraid Antagon will pull all sorts of lethal traps. Well, I suppose that wraps up this drama episode. I think you have just saved me from losing my job. I cannot thank you enough. We made it. I can't believe it. Great job, our protagonist. I can, call can I call you that? The word seems to be catching on anyways. I don't like the word at all. Alright. So, uh, alright guys. I think that's enough Super Paper Roblox that we're going to play today. Uh, leave a like if you really like this series, uh, I really would appreciate it. Um, subscribe today to become a Mophie slash Opius today, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye